At least two people have been killed and seven injured after massive shelling pummeled the eastern Ukrainian city of Slovyansk, officials say. City mayor, the Dim Lyak, called on residents to evacuate after Russian forces struck a market and a residential area. The governor of the Donetsk region has also urged 350,000 civilians to evacuate in light of an imminent Russian offensive. Pavlo Kirilenko said that getting people out is necessary to save lives and to enable the Ukrainian army to better defend towns from the Russian advance. Ukraine's governor of Luhansk said on Wednesday that fighting continues in the villages around Lysykansk. Serhai Haidai said some settlements have already been under one or another control twice. He repeated that up to 15,000 civilians remain in Lysykansk and 8,000 in Severodonetsk, adding today's videos from Lysykansk are painful to watch. The battle for Slovyansk is likely to be the next key contest in the struggle for Donbass as Russian forces approach within 16 km of the Donetsk town, the United Kingdom Ministry of Defense said on Wednesday. Russian forces from the eastern and western groups of forces are likely now around 16 km north of Slovyansk as central and southern groups of forces also pose a threat to the town, according to the latest British intelligence report. Austria has begun the process of ejecting the Russian energy company, Gazprom, from its major gas storage facility at Haydak. In order not to miss the news, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell, I am waiting for your comment on the news.